tonight at 10, KTK News has learned the likely reason a young East Texas couple was hanging out with a man twice their age, a man now charged with their murders. The killings happened overnight on Ridgewood Drive. That's near the UT Tyler campus. Tonight, KTK's My Owens reports exclusive new information about what brought them together. 25-year-old Krista Newman of Frankston and 26-year-old Caleb McGrady of Tyler were shot to death outside of this home. But to friends, they were more than victims. Instead, a young couple taken too soon. He's like an angel. Guy in a guy's body kind of thing. Nicest guy ever. Uh, he just about do anything you ask him to. We need to help with something. He's there. He'd give the shirt off his back if he didn't have no clothes, whatever. He's that kind of guy. Miller has known McGrady for more than 10 years, and they were more than friends, like family. We've done so, so many things together ever since growing up, pretty much. It's like my brother, best friend, brother. But I don't know. <laughs> He's there for everybody. Everybody loved him. Miller received a call from his mother earlier this morning telling him what happened, a violent crime that was out of the norm for this neighborhood. It's over here, and I'm just like, what's going on, you know? Mm -hmm. um, it's, Tyler's not safe anymore, for sure. We talked to a man who lives in this house. He says the couple were here for a party, celebrating a band McGrady liked. A band Harvey Martin managed, when all of a sudden Martin allegedly shot the couple outside. After the shooting, Martin drove himself to the Tyler Police Department. He's now at the Smith County Jail on a $1 million bond. If you could say something to him right now, what would you say? Shh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Miller says for now he has to move on and wait for the day he can see his friend again. My Owens, KETK News.